Yo, what is good, YouTube, and welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're doing gameplay with the brand new Dark Matter Markel Foltz. This is one of the four limited reward options for this season. You can get him, you can get John Stockton, Don O, or Jamal Murray. And I personally believe that Markel Foltz is the best limited option to get. And I really do think he has the potential to be a super solid PG option as well, just in general in my team. I think he's going to be a really, really good card, and I'm excited to use the card, see how good he can be. Before we hop into the video, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button help me push towards the 5,000 subscriber mark on the channel i upload every single day and i would really appreciate your support if you haven't already if you do subscribe you'll hear that noise in the background i apologize my neighbor's getting the yard work done um so i apologize about that not much i can do about it though uh but yeah also huge shout out to my boy jeezy for letting me help on his account to record this video uh really do appreciate his support letting me do this video with markel uh but yeah without further ado let's hop right into it let's see what markel is looking like so markel is a 99 overall point guard shooting guard option uh, would play him at point guard, 6'4 with a 99 offense and defense, 96 driving layup, 92 mid-range, 93 pointer, 95 driving dunk, 95 ball handle, 88 block, 80 interior, 95 steel, 95 perimeter, 96 speed, speed ball and acceleration, and a 95 lateral quickness. So statistically, very, very good card. 95 driving and flashy dunk tendency. Defensive tendencies are also 95 and then 85 on the contestant block shot tendency. Badge-wise, comes with 31 hops to include catch and shoot, difficult shots, fearless finisher, acrobat, ankle breaker, hyperdrive, dimer, pickpocket, pick dodger clamps quick chain interceptor intimidator posterizer pogo stick tireless defender mismatch expert giant slayer slithery downhill quick first step space creator unpluckable sniper unstrippable bullet passer ankle braces limitless takeoff floor general fast switch and menace as well as 30 golds which include glue hands chase down artist rebound chaser post lockdown limitless chef bailout handles for days set shooter tight handles dead eye hots and hunter uh volume shooter ball stripper and hustler also could use badges added brick wall and rim protector are two very key ones to add blinders as well other than that you could add a slippery off ball green machine things like that but outside of blinders rim protector and brick wall it doesn't really need much all right hopping into freestyle let's see what markel can do the one thing that i will say about this card that is a little bit disappointing is the fact that he's only got handles for days on gold that's like my biggest complaint with the card is that he doesn't have that on hall of fame uh, other than that though he's got the steph curry base on very quick with a good upper it is very smooth very fast very easy to green just a really good all-around jumper y'all know how good the steph curry jumper is every single year in my team and he's the first card i'm pretty sure with it on very quick so that is super nice obviously uh and yeah i just think he's going to give you a lot on the basketball court um on both ends really i think especially offensively defensively he's a little bit small but his defensive badges are good and i do think he's going to still be a very acceptable defender but the fact of the matter is six four without a super elite player build i would say i don't feel like his player build is super phenomenal uh and that's one thing to keep in mind when you are using the card is the fact that he's just not going to have the greatest player build ever but i do think he is going to be a very good card still and i'm excited to use him especially offensively because as a slasher as a playmaker all those things i think he should be elite again wish he had half handles for days but other than that i think he He's going to be really, really good. Does he have dribble moves only on it? Wouldn't let me safe duck. I'm confused. Uh, where would I even change that? Dribble moves only. Yeah, I'm gonna put that on default because I want to be able to safe dunk with my stick. But there we go. Uh, safe dunk. That's a great safe dunk. Quick drop. Not gonna get blocked. Love to see it. Let's hop into a game. Let's see what Markel Foltz can do. All right, hop into this game. Let's see what Markel can do. Uh, this dude's got a uh, really solid squad, to be completely honest. He's got D-Rob. He's got uh, Bob Nedelicki, which means he's a solid player from Unlimited, Desmond Bain, Mikael Bridges, and Steve Francis. So a pretty comparable squad to mine, to be completely honest. Mine might be a little bit better, but his squad definitely isn't bad. Let's cut him off middle. Good D, and we're not going to get a block. That's tough. Markel not quite able to keep up on the perimeter, and Steve Francis gets to the rim and throws down a dunk uh, behind the back, though. Yes, sir. Markel, slot, drag back, slash right, left, go up strong. Come on, Markel, throw it down yes sir beautiful not stopped by d-rob in the way able to throw down the dunk and he's got a quick five points on the game which is definitely a really solid start i gotta see some defense out of him though good d uh cut him off good markel beautiful good defense markel good d great defensive position. Ooh, i did not mean to jump there but we're still gonna wind up with a stop i think we are yes let's go beautiful a um, little bit worried there at the end of the possession because i accidentally jumped with kp but overall Really, really solid start. Let's get the ball right back into Markel as well. He's going to overplay the steal, I think, a little bit. Um, oh, good defense. That's actually a really solid defensive play by him. He didn't wind up getting the stop, but he did play a good defensive possession. Kick to the corner. Bob Nedelicki for three. Chicken. Yes, sir. Knocking that down. We will take our easy open three. We got a little bit lucky there because he played good defense uh, getting that bump and wasn't able to, unfortunately, get the stop, which is unfortunate for him, but fortunate for me. But Markel showing me something on the defensive end. I'm actually really liking it. Good switch as well. Great defense. Beautiful defensive possession. This is absolutely blocked and that's a block and we are hoping gonna get a quit as well beautiful great triple threat i'm sorry great clutch time game let's hop into triple threat let's keep it going markel 
All right, hopping into triple threat. We just got two spacers on the floor with KP and then Bob, and then we have uh, Markel to go do the mass, vast majority of the scoring and shot creation. He's able to get to the rim and throw it down. I'm loving the way this card moves. That's one thing I really like. As a short guard with pretty good sigs, he's going to move very well in game, which is something beneficial that he gives you. I will say player build is not elite. Uh, at only six foot four, he doesn't have the greatest of player builds. Not able to get a block on that either on Jaw, which is okay. Uh, Jaw's obviously a very elite slasher, but uh, he doesn't have the greatest of player builds. He's not super tall or anything, you know what I mean? So uh, he's not going to move. I mean, he's not going to be the most elite like perimeter defender, but his, in terms of his offensive ability, he is absolutely elite. I'm not able to knock that one down, but that is okay. Cut off the ball here. Good D. Um, let's see if we can get a stop. Come on. Good D. This guy is, it seems like he actually kind of knows what he's doing, which is interesting because his team stinks, but he does seem like he kind of knows what he's doing. So that is a little interesting, but uh, good D. Good D. Beautiful. He's boxed. He's boxed. This should be a stop. This should be a stop. It is a stop. Markel Fultz with a nice interceptor play. He didn't think I was going to click on and get the steal there. Drag back. Burst here. Yes, sir. Drag back again. Come on, baby. Come on, man. Beautiful. Attack the rim. Markel Fultz throwing it down, and we're up for it, too. Good steal, Markel. Yes, sir, baby. He is hooping. He's got two steals on the game as well. Uh, let's see if we can get a three-point opportunity this possession. I don't think this jaw is the greatest of defensive cards, so hopefully we should be able to get one. He's got good lateral quickness, though. Clearly, he's able to stick with me pretty well. But he accidentally clicks. Oh, messed that defensive possession up. And we got a full bar. That is so annoying. This game sucks, bro. I get a wide open look, and it shoots a full. It doesn't give me the green. And then I wind up shooting a lightly and missing it. That's so annoying, because that's just going to hurt his shooting percentage. Just uh, two misses instead of one make. But it is what it is. Uh, still a good shot by Markel. Got a good look, just wasn't able to convert, unfortunately, because the game sucks and full bars are a thing. But um, still have all, only four points in the game, so let's see if we can keep it going. He's just hard off balling. Uh, it's just the way he's playing. It's all right, though. Uh, hit it inside to KP. He's going to jump, and we're going to take our assist. If he's going to off ball that hard, we're going to take advantage of it instead, and we will pass the ball with Markel. All right, let's keep it going on offense. Markel, attack again. Yes, sir. Drag back. Chill. Chill. Can we get the freaking six that I'm trying to do, bro? Why? There. Can I green, bro? Offensive rebound, kick it back out. Come on, Markel. Go get a bucket, baby. Yo. I, I don't know. I was struggling to score the ball offensively. I'll be completely honest. I'm not playing very well in this triple threat game, but that is okay. He's still got four points and two assists, which is a decent start to the game. Let's see if we can get a stop. Um, Cut him off. Good defense. That's a stop right there. And we're going to get the board. Beautiful. I thought I wasn't going to get the board. We are going to manage to get the board. Uh, burst here. Yes, sir. Wide open. Markel Foles, 4-3. Knockdown. Yes, sir. Beautiful. I'm liking this card. His release is so good. That's that's one thing about this card that is really, really good. I love his release. It's super fast, super smooth. Just a big, big fan of the release for sure. As he gets dunked on. Job Morant, bro. It's just a slasher. I don't know, man. He he is very one of the best slashers in the game. And he just, I don't know. He's tough to stop in that area. But uh, Which is realistic because that's how he is in real life as well. But uh, uh, come on, Markel. Drag back. Burst. Stop. Hit it inside to Bob. Yes, sir. We'll take our dunk. Great playmaking ability. We're up 13 to 8. Yes, sir. There we go, Markel. Getting a block. Beautiful stuff. Uh, push the ball in transition behind the back. Uh, another drag back. His movement is super nice, which is something that I'm a big fan of about the card. Um, but unfortunately, I didn't mean to hit that to KP. I actually meant to pump fake, and I had my icons up. So quick stop. Nope. Hit it over to KP. He is, oh, I got him looking. I caught him looking there. We're going to get a nice little assist there. Markel filling up the stat sheet. He's got seven points, four assists, and a rebound. And I think he's got two steals as well. So he is filling up the stat sheet for sure. And a block. I, didn't for, I completely forgot about the block. He is absolutely hooping. I love that. Uh, but let's get a pick and pop here going. See if we can actually get a little bit more attention on KP now that he's got takeover and take advantage of it get Markel a look and the answer is no I cannot get Markel a look so we're just going to take our dunk with KP if he's going to keep switching and off balling and things like that and making it tough for Markel to score then we will take advantage of what he has given up which is those assists for Markel seven and five in this game uh, let's see if we can get a three this next possession though and finish the game we get a nice little block and we got takeover with Markel which is beautiful uh, I don't even care if my opponent scores at this point to be completely honest I just want the ball back and I just want to finish the game um Feel free. Go up. I don't care. Shoot the ball. Cool. You got a bucket. Very nice. Congratulations. Now Markel's going to break your ankles or something because I think I got shot creating takeover and uh, that might mean ankle breaker. So we're going to try to get like a step back animation or something. No ankle breaker there. We're going to quick stop and we're going to shoot the three and we're going to green it. Markel Fultz with that elite release able to quick stop and knock down a three. Finishing with 10 points, one rebound, five assists, two steals and a block. What a stat stuffing game. Four of eight, two of six from three. Efficiency wasn't amazing, but he played really good as a whole. Let's hop back to the main menu and let's review the card.
In conclusion, I really do think Markel Fultz was the best option that you could have picked out of your limited rewards. Really, really solid PG option. Is he a top tier point guard in the game? He's not. He doesn't have the size to be a top tier point guard. I think that's really the thing that holds him back the most. I didn't really notice any issues with gold handles today. He's not Hall of Fame. To be completely honest, I didn't feel like he was too tired or anything like that. And I love his release. He's an elite offensive card, but I just think his lack of size is going to hurt him a bit defensively and prevent him from being true top tier. But he's one of the most fun point guards to use and one of the best small PGs in my team definitely a really fun card if you did pick him up you're gonna enjoy using him in my team so hopefully you did enjoy the video if you did make sure you hit that like button leave a comment and subscribe i'll be back with more 2k content very very soon and i appreciate y'all peace